Hey guys, Anton's the man here with more Mass Effect Andromeda. Where we last left off, we were taking care of shady business upon that criminal world. I can't even remember the name of it, but you know what I mean if you've been watching. And when we got back on the ship, a lot of people had hey, their opinions to can share. I see you in the med bay? And apparently I'm needed in the med bay. <laughs> but um, yeah, there's a lot going on now. Um, Drac in particular brought up the Krogan colony ship needed to be looked into. Uh, PB just wants to have fun all the time. And, um, oh, hold on. I left my volume on for my computer. Don't want that echo going on. <laughs> that, it's a good thing I could hear myself through my headset. Anyways, um, and it was Cora who wanted us to go straight to our main goal, which seems, you know, it makes sense. But at the same time, we kind of want allies, you know, during our assault. So, I don't know, it could be a little too reckless just jumping in and sacrificing everyone else who needs help. So, hopefully we get a good stream going. <laughs> I guess it just depends on what I end up doing. Let's start by selling scrap that we don't want. Um, that's a shotgun. I don't really use shotguns. Element zero. I wish I had a better idea of what I needed to, for crafting. Like, it's too bad you can't flag recipes you're interested in. Or at least I don't think you can. I guess we'll check out our research too. No idea what I want. Maybe an SMG stuff. And N7 stuff seems pretty cool, but I think I have a really awesome set of armor. And it's going to be hard to really beat that one. When hovering, biotic damage does 35% more. Huh. It sounds good, but it sounds really, really situational. Like, I basically have to be always casting Biotics while up in the air. Hmm. Increased weapon accuracy by 10 when standing still. Nah, none of that interests me. I guess I'll just look into weapons. I guess this is the one I was beefing up, so I'll keep doing that. There, it's maxed out. So, what else do we got? Projectiles bounce off flat surfaces and now travel in a ballistic arc. Ammo drain. Seeking plasma bolts. That's actually pretty good. I've already researched that though. Hmm. And is this the one that has the awesome armor? Yeah. Let's keep researching the awesome armor then. It's done us pretty good. I wonder which would be better to improve though the helmet or the suit. suit I guess is better because it gives damage resistance so that's the most oh we could get the helmet too at one why not I don't mind improving both I'll just save up more points until we max those out and I have no idea what I'm doing with this research let's check out the augments we haven't messed too much around with those when weapon now fires a sustained energy beam, the accuracy deals rapid damage to target. Hmm. That could be pretty cool. Let's research that. Cryo ammo freeze duration. 
disruptor damage. What's with the jump melee? That sounds weird. On enemy kill, restore 25% shield? Dang. That sounds pretty good. The cryo stuff sounds cool too. Even though I don't really seem to use any of these special ammos. Anything cool we can make? Like, can I make the awesome helmet now? I think this is the new one I got. Is there any way to compare? I guess not. Hmm. Actually, is there any augments we can make? Wow, apparently we have a lot of this stuff we can make. Allow stability assist, which is always default. Expert drivers control assist. Make it more agile, sure. Improve the shield strength, sure. Oh, we need element zero for that. Faster regen, we need PT for that, whatever that is. I'm guessing platinum, more element zero, more PT. So we need a lot of PT and easy. Can I still afford this? Yes, let's do it. Wait, where's the augments? Is it? No, this is just everything, whatever. What augments are we going to put on it? Hmm. What? Power damage bonus. Combat. Duration. Health. Combo radius. I guess we'll do power damage and radius. Wait, that wasn't radius. There we go. I hope I just didn't make the same thing we already have. the main armor. Oh, I see. Okay, we'll make this also. Power damage. Power damage. Combo? Nah. Hmm. Let's just do this. Call that good. Is there any assault rifles we want to make? This one needs element zero. How does it compare to the gun I have? Pretty well. So it'd be pretty awesome to have this. Let's see if we can get some element zero and PT. Sorry, this is a little whatever gamey. It's just part of the game. It's what I tend to do in games like this. I know it's not the most fun thing to watch.
All right. Well, thankfully we're done, but now we're going to check our strike missions really quick. I feel like I haven't messed with this in a long time. Oscar squad, you're good. Uniform, you failed. Dang it. And November, succeed. Nice. Claim all the rewards. Still need five more points to recruit another squad. Hmm. Wish I could just organize these by difficulty. Let's send November to this. How is uniform do against these? 55. Eh. should be fine. Now we're gonna talk to people. Well, I was requested to go to the med bay, so let's go there first. At least we know for sure something's probably new gonna happen there. What you gotta say? Everything all right? Oh, yes. PB and I were just having a debate. That's one word for it. You mean argument? No, that would be unprofessional. <laughs> if you say so. Ryder, do you think I'm uptight? I. No, never mind. Don't answer that. Let's just talk about something else. Really? Is that all you called me to the med bay for? To talk oh, about an argument? I'll be here if you need me. Sheesh. That seemed kind of a waste. Oh, while well, we're down here... Why is my scanner going off? That was weird. I don't see anything to scan. Well, hopefully it was nothing. Like it was right here. It did it again. Hmm. Oh, I see it. What is that? Hmm. Crumbs. Crumbs on the deck. You found them too? I think something's eating our stores. Follow the crumb trail. What crumb trail? I don't see any tr crumb trail. It's creepy something's on here though. Eating our food. It'll probably vibrate again. As if any of your meals passed the bucket test. Picture your favorite food. Now picture it in a bucket beside a barn. Would you still eat it? Hey, Liam. Hey, Pathfinder. Still passing that mess with Varan and Khaled. I made sure the Nexus data will be changed. Kesh is none too happy, but she can blame me. The important thing is we're all alive, I'm all in, and I'm doing things different now. Understood. Accepted, Liam. Let's not do this again anytime soon. Oh, total agreement there. In fact, this made me think how I'm doing a lot of things. I want to arrange a thing for us and the Angara, once their civil stuff is calmer. Maybe talk to Jal about the Roka. You lend your weight there, I can focus on something normal for everyone. Cool. Another Liam quest? Advance Jaws friend or foe mission. Okay. You have anything else, Liam? 
Tev Uni. A home in Vold. Sort of. Still feels good, though. Um, we're done. <laughs> we'll talk later. I know it. And since we're here, let's look at the message board. Two of them. Okay. Go send B. To cling or to grasp. Say, go send. See also, go send var der ad adjective, I guess. Being stubborn, like cling to a rock. See also, go sevar noun, the resistance, jaw. Comment, so the resistance means stubborn, pig-headed people, PB? That would be Gosavara, and yes. <laughs> Lost this from my workbench um, yesterday, and I'm really hoping to have it fall through to deck plating. It didn't fall through to deck plating. I borrowed it to fix a loose sole on my boot. I'm almost done. <laughs> Liam, Liam, can I grab that quickly after? Need to patch a strap, Cora. Oh, the pilot seat cushion just needs a quick fix to Kalo. That would really help a rickety shelf I've got down here. Vetra, I built another hot patch gun. You guys can fight over that one. <laughs> Any crumbs here? Nope. I wonder if there's any in my room. Now I'm all paranoid about this thing living on our ship. Guess we'll check emails while we're here. Oh man, there's so many emails. Holy cow. Okay. First thing first. Asari Ark. Had a breakthrough on the location of the Asari Ark. Please come talk to me on the Tempest ASAP. Acknowledged. Writer from Vetra. Writer. An encrypted message came from Sid. Says she wants to talk to a, a sounds urgent. Going to need you on this one, so swing when you can. Dang, I'm going to be overloaded with quests. <laughs> to Writer from Mosha Sa Fa. Pathfinder, Jal expressed that you wish to meet with Aksul. It has been a long time since he and I spoke. He has so changed by the cat that it was difficult to talk to him, but perhaps another time has passed, and together we can reason with him. I've arranged a meeting at my laboratory on Aya. Please come at your earliest convenience. Ishari Moshai Sefa. Seha. Okay. Raise Vidal. Writer, something interesting just fell into my lap. Call me when you have a minute, Raze. Okay. Two writer from Avitus Ricks. I don't even know, remember who this is. <laughs> I'm hearing rumors that scavengers found pieces of an ark on a planet called Illidan. Might be nothing but worth checking out. Avitus. Okay. Two writer from Director... Jaron Tan. When we left our home, we never planned on having to negotiate with an alien civilization for a new one. It's vital we place it, placate the Angara and keep them on our side, of course. They've opened an embassy on Aya, and our diplomatic team is already settling in. I'm counting on you to ensure our success. You've established ties with the resistance leader and Moshe and Aya's governor. Do all you can to learn anything about them and their supporters. The better we understand Aya's political structure, the more successful we'll be gaining their help colonizing Helios. Director Tan. Okay. Error 982. Carrier signal interrupted. Invitation. To writer from unknown sender. Writer. I must be brief, but I hear my virus was a success and Sam is disconnected. Excellent news. We should talk to in person. 
I've enclosed the nap point for our sanctuary on Kadara. The virus was only a first step. You could be a strong ally in future efforts. Night. Notification 347. Carrier signal interruption resolved. Great. I'm really... I'm really hesitant about these weirdos. Ah, so many emails. We have nine more to go through. To Ryder from Captain Dunn. Ryder, please see me on Hyperion deck to discuss sensitive matters. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Ryder from Sid... Sid... Sidera Nix. Okay, whatever. Dear Pathfinder, this is Sidera Vetra's sister, but everyone calls me Sid. I know this isn't following protocol because who am I to contact the, a Pathfinder through the personal console, right? But I know Vetra will tell me to, I'm overreacting, and I swear I wouldn't do this unless I thought it was something serious. There's just something going on here and doesn't really add up, and people are getting hurt. It's hard to explain. Can we talk in person? I'm in operations. Thanks. Sid E R A Sidare Nix. Okay, whatever. Let's just add that to the pile. Uh Carrie to Vesa. Hello, Ryder. They're saying you just got back from Kadara Port. There isn't much official world for there or the exiles. Can you give me a few on-camera details? Oh, okay, that's the um, reporter. Okay. You're making ra waves. Man, my email gets so spammed by all these guys. Spread the word of, at Tartarus, and I import of your expert handling of Rokar. I only made a few embellishments and left out my involvement, of course. Wouldn't want to steal your spotlight, Rays. Thanks, pal. To Ryder from Vetra. Hey, Ryder. One of my friends from Kadara sent a list of tips for surviving there. Isn't it common? It's mostly common sense, but there are some gems. No one knows who the charlatan is. Asking dangerous. Okay, asking is dangerous. Be really careful dealing with Sloane and anyone who works for her. Politics on Kadara are less about who's getting the bigger stick and more about who's willing to use the sticks that they have to create in creative ways. Okay. There's a hole in the wall place in the slums that makes the best cup of Quillow. Quilloa. Do not mix Quilloa with other stimulants, no matter what anyone says. Humans only. Don't ask Umi, the bartender, tender to surprise you. Two Rider from the Nexus Cultural Exchange. Two Rider. Pathfinder Rider. We are currently hosting the first Agar and Ambassador to the Nexus. Isa de Nevar. Despite the importance of your duties, we hope your next return to the station will coincide with his visit. The cordial meeting between the Pathfinder, First Reach Aya, and Angar Ambassador could set the tone for our relations in the future. Respectfully yours, Luana Tispara, Chief Staff, Nexus Cultural Exchange. Okay. To writer from Drac. Last time I was on Kadara, I met the Sasari at Kralas who said she let me in on a little score. Apparently there's this matriarch who came over on the Nexus. Only she died in stasis. My contact says she's next in line for the old lady's credit. A lot of credits. And get this, she'll say she'll split them with me. Trouble is, there's red tape, transfer fees, and she's having trouble mustering up the credits to clear them. Asked me if I could cover the transfer cost. I tried to bring Vetra in on this, but she says it's a scam. I'm not so sure. Seems like a pretty good opportunity to me. Hmm. I don't really want to be just tossing my credits here and there. To writer from Drac. Oh, instant reply. It was a scam. Do me a favor and don't tell Vetra, okay? <laughs> Two rider from Vetra. 
Ryder, whatever Suvi's cooking up in the galley smells terrible. She says it's for movie night. Good, because bad choice of snack. Um, I can do better. Come see me and I'll show you. To Ryder from Drag. Thought I'd show you what Strux sent me. A transcript of audio log that got me worried about the colony. Sounds like Morda's cooking up something. Don't know what to say. Morda, stop arguing with me, Brank. It's payback time for the initiative. They don't care about us, but they will. Soon they're going to know that I'm Overlord, and once I execute my plan, there'll be no denying that the Krogan rule Helios. Then they'll come begging to us. Okay, Morda, I'll get a team together. Gather everything we need. No Krogan bows down to the Nexus again. Wow. That sounds awesome and scary at the same time. <laughs> Holy cow, guys, we have a lot to do. How are we ever going to get this all done? <laughs> so the Angara were fighting their own this whole time. Fuck. Wonder how they all take it. Not well. Hey, Cora. We got it, Ryder. You patched up the Asari flight recorder? Some old access codes, a little data recovery from Sam. We have the Asari Ark's last heading. Nav points are set. We can head there whenever you're ready. Remember the survey ship? This might not be pretty. Are you... Handling tough stuff is my job. We need the Asari and Sarissa more than ever. I trust you to find them before the Ket do. We got this. Oh. Scanner's going up again. Where's the crumbs? Must be in Liam's room. We already scanned the couch, so that can't be... What's setting off the thing? Man, scanning's so annoying in this game, I tell ya. Is there something in there, or is just the light playing tricks on me? Just the light, I guess. There it is. Crumbs. Something's nesting here. Something that likes cereal. I wonder. We've probably got materials to build a humane trap and catch it. Build a trap? Hmm. Well, let's talk to people before we do that. Hey, Ryder. Got an encrypted message from Sid. She has news and wanted to talk to us both. Connecting the call now. Finally! I've been waiting for hours! So you want to tell us what this is all about? I was listening to outpost updates and caught a message about settlers going missing. That doesn't sound good. Yeah, because it's not. They were kidnapped. <laughs> I dug around, and I think I know where they've been taken. A cave on a moon in the Ramav system. Originally an Angaran mine, I think, but they abandoned it. I don't believe the planet you're talking about is a moon. Whatever. What did I tell you about getting involved? I couldn't just do nothing. How do we know your intel's even reliable? It's reliable. Hmm. We should look into it. I trust your sister, and there's no sense in wasting time. See? That's a pathfinder. Sid, just give us everything you have on this. Already done. Could I come along? I want to help. No. <sighs> you know the answer to that. Right, of course. Stay away from bad people, guns, bombs, Krogan beer. Krogan beer? <laughs> you did good. I just want you to be safe, okay? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, anything else you want to say? 
Suvi. Gotta love her, but those green snack things she's making for Liam's movie night? Let's just say they're probably better suited to throwing at the screen. You've got <laughs> a better idea? Yeah, actually. Cora lent me an initiative access code so I could track down some contraband. Long story short, someone on Kadara Port has popcorn. And Grexen, which is like your popcorn, only better because I can eat it. Popcorn's contraband? Someone smuggled popcorn across galaxies? It's light and people would pay big credits for it. Why not? Fair enough. I could track some down the next time we're there. Thanks. It would be nice to have a treat out here, you know? Anything else? Kadara is a lifesaver. I'd promised some people some things I wasn't sure I could get. Turns out I can get them all on Kadara. Funny how things work out. Well, I gotta survive somehow. I'm just relieved that they didn't die out there without Nexus support. Throwing people off the boat was hard, but Nexus leadership was desperate. Wasn't a great choice. Lose some people, or lose everything. Yep. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. I guess I should check if Cora has any more to say. Pirates, exiles, severed heads. Kadara Port's a peach, huh? And Reyes treats it all like a game. Anything you needed? Nope. Just wanted to see, see you later, Cora. I'll be here. Next, Drac. Ryder. Apparently you have nothing. All right. We can talk more later. Sure. We'll be seeing more of him when we help out the Krogan. Gil, here's that cat transponder. The spy used it to get his orders. What do we need from it? The location it points to should give us a fix on the Archon's ship. <sighs> right. No pressure. It's not like there's much riding on this. Just our best chance to find Meridian. Pressure. I like that. Luckily, no matter where you go in the universe, physics still applies. Only so many ways of communicating across space. There. Give it a shot. Did you connect the... <laughs> Shit, turn it off. Careful. That is a direct line to people who want to murder everyone on this ship. Sam? I have the coordinates. The signal points to the Tafino system. We sure we want to do this? I know we're still getting our feet wet, but I don't see another choice. <laughs> I knew running off to Andromeda would be dangerous, but shit. This is dangerous. Only if we die. We've done plenty of dangerous stuff so far. Hey, Ryder. What's the story? The story Good is I'm out. Anytime. See ya. Guess we'll build that humane trap. Wherever it is, so it's over here. Sure, just use some of our aluminum. Then what? Place trap at the creature's lair. I'm not sure which is its lair. Maybe the second one we found. The track moved. That's kind of weird. Gonna set a trap. One trap ready for a visitor. 
I'll leave it and see what we get. It's gonna be Vetra. We all know that she likes cereal. I mean, let's look over here. It's clearly cereal we got in here. So next time, we're gonna find Vetra in the trap. <laughs> Should be stuck in it head first. I haven't seen Jaw. Wonder where he is. I guess I never checked his actual room. Yeah, that's right. I went straight to the med bay. Hey, Jaw. <laughs> Didn't mean to scare you. Whoa. What? Uh, I'm, I'm not scared. Uh, one second. What's going on in here? You look busy. If I'm busy, my mind is occupied with whatever I'm working on, uh, rather than worrying. Whatever gets you through. Uh, I'd like your advice on something. I'm making gifts for everyone. Really? I have a list. Gifts? Hmm. Do Turians like poetry? Uh, for Vetra, I'm writing a poem and engraving it on... Uh, well, uh, I'm not sure yet. Um, I don't know. Everyone, Everyone's their own person. I'm sure there's some Turians out there that like poetry, but I never was struck that Vetra liked it. Um, <laughs> I'm sure she'd still enjoy the um, sentiment, though. I don't know. Probably not. She's a Turian. She might like something a little more hands-on. Hmm. Good to know. I'll think about that. Uh, Liam seems to like my Rothjin. I might sew him one. He does. Do Krogan like knives? I could craft a ceremonial Angaran dagger for Drac. Um, sure. I mean, it's a weapon. <laughs> but ceremonial usually aren't meant for weapons. I don't know. Sure. Who wouldn't want that? It's mainly decorative. Would you like one? Jal, this is a lot of work. What's really going on? I'm sure that I seem confident and skilled to you, but I'm not. Or I don't feel like I am. Well, a lot of people are like that about themselves. They don't see the greatness of who they actually are. Only others can really see, you know, your great qualities. Because you're your worst critic. I feel like that a lot. <laughs> Good to know. Yes, thanks for sharing that. Just be yourself. My family is well known. Our lineage is respected. And many of my kin have achieved great things. I've never been one of them. So many older siblings and cousins who succeeded at everything. I stopped trying to keep up. Right. Thanks for listening. You're doing great things here with us, Jaw. Not everyone can say they saved a figurehead of their people. You're not in anyone's shadow here. I believe in you. My reports from Ephra regarding Aksul are worrying. I don't understand how the Rokha manages to recruit so many. I'll see you later, John. Stay strong and clear. Well, that was a nice little interaction. I'm curious to see what Drak thinks of the knife John makes him. I 
wonder if I need to equip that new armor I got. Yeah, I do. I do. It's a pretty cool helmet. Too bad it's not that good for me. Cool, cool. Hmm. Yeah, whatever. I think that was everything. Yeah, that was everything. PB? Kadara port's pretty grisly, huh? Probably get into all sorts of trouble there. Yeah. And now we're going after the Archon's ship? Mm hmm Sure that's a good idea. In the absence of any others, it's an excellent one. Guess I can't argue with that. Anything else to go over? Nope. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. Subi? Anything I can help with? No. I should get back to things. Sounds good. Callow? Ryder, might I borrow your research room access? What for? I guess. There's a small something I need to take care of. I might need your help, if you could. Sure. I'll help if I can. Subi, could you take the helm for a little while? I mostly need your authorization to add to the database. Is that our drive core? The full blueprint. Only a few are in the system. I had them all by memory. So I drew them out. Every line. All the specs. Gil will be needing them. I won't. You're still not comfortable with Gil being in charge of your Tempest, are you? Call it more memories. Of the time that they were going to scrap the whole project. Some engineering consultant kept insisting the ship would never fly right. He used a lot of Gil's arguments. I think that's why this hurts. The others died thinking we won, that their legacy was safe, and... I failed them. Oh, man. Now I feel bad. The original Tempest is preserved forever now, thanks to you. It's safer than ever. We forget all our technology didn't just appear. Someone invented it. Someone cared. And in the end, someone new always takes up the banner and pushes forward. I am... Um, I need the tech officer's sign off on these schematics. Any thoughts on how to do this? Gil, got a minute? I need you in the research room. Be right there. I thought we settled this. What's going on? I saved the Tempest schematics for you. It'll be easier with them on hand. Seeing her drawn out down to the basics, she's kind of beautiful. Oh, right. You never saw. Yeah. Look at the arc here. That's artistry. And there. Huh. Well, I feel a lot better now. I hope things um, pan out well with them now. Holy cow. What mission are we going to do now? There's so much on our plate. Now orbiting Kadara. Better snacks. We could just keep going with that. I just want to see what all our options are. Dang! There's so much! <laughs> wow. There's so much to do. 
Okay, we're definitely putting hunting the Archon on the back burner right now. There's just way too much extra stuff to do. I don't even know where to start. Maybe I should look at my my hub. My not hub, my journal. So we have three priority missions. Um, I don't even remember this. What did she want over here? Oh, Turian Arc? Oh yeah, I, I kind of remember that from the meeting. I do want to do this. That's going to be a fun one, I think. That's on hold. Ugh, this one I'm concerned about. Oh wait, no, that's not the one. But this is also one I want to check out. We have more memories we can check. We can f try to find the Ark. We can investigate an anomaly. We can talk to Sam on the Tempest. What's that about? I guess we'll do that. We're right here. What does Sam have to say about it? Pathfinder, I've retrieved actionable intel from the security vid of Spender. What did you find? Updating your system with an app point. Okay. Anything else, Sam? Hello, Scott. Kodar report has raised questions for the future. What questions? If we succeed in Andromeda, more AI will be created. We are all individuals. Some may commit illegal acts. But if AI are also citizens, there must be laws and penalties for us, too. I wonder what form they will take. Yeah, it's hard to say. Thanks, Sam. Nothing more. What else? Speak to the Moshi. Find leads on Solarian Arc. So I think that's one that's kind of on hold. Evaluate Kadara for Outpost. Read email from PB. I have a new email? What? I know there's someone over here you can read emails. I could have sworn. Mm, I'm thinking of upstairs. Yeah. I'm thinking of the upstairs here. Oh yeah, and there was a spot next to Sam you can read emails. Whatever. Man, I just finished reading all these emails and I'm getting more emails. This is so ridiculous. You've got a new remnant project in the works. It's going to be big. Come say hi in my room on the Tempest, will you? All right. From Jal, I told Liam and PB of Lexi and Lexi a child, children's story that the mother used to tell me when we were small. It's from our oral history of time before the scourge. The crew said I should write it down so it could be added to the cultural center on the Nexus. The wayward child. Long ago, there was a child who was very stubborn and wouldn't listen to any wisdom, not from her, her father nor her many mothers. One day, seeking adventure, she snuck aboard a spaceship with an unknown destination. That child was brave to seek adventure. However, she ended up being spaced with a load of garbage. Deservedly, she froze in the cold vacuum of space and died. The end. Wow. That's morbid. I don't know why the crew enjoyed it. It's a terrible story meant to scare youngsters into obedience. Is this a novelty to your people? If so, how do you humans keep children from hurting themselves? Jaw. Wow. Okay. Puck, puck, puck. You're going to be the gateway to so many great things, my friend. Hey there. 
You named her Pac? Yep. Proof of concept. To distinguish her from Zap, your souped-up, nasty combat version. Zap. I like it. Yeah, it's edgy. The storage <laughs> box from the vault on EOS was the key to everything, including integrating that piece of rent tech you got me. But our new Observer friends are just the beginning. I'm working on something even bigger. Of course you are. Sure, why stop and smell the roses? Getting remnant technology to work is so passe. I'm not one to rest on my laurels. So get this. We can only scan for remnant signatures we've already encountered. My scanner's doing that around the clock. But if I integrate the right rem tech, we could scour the cluster for any remnant signature, even ones we don't have. My scanner would literally become a remnant mystery detector. Uh, cool. Your enthusiasm is infectious. <laughs> well, don't tell Lexi. She'll look for a cure. I came to Andromeda to touch the unknown. To find the never-before-found. Once I perfect this scanner, it'll do exactly that. All I need is three specific pieces of Remtech. We can do that. You? Rock. Pock and Zap think so, too. So far, I've located the first piece. It's back on EOS. I'll upload the coordinates. Cool. What the heck? I'm like spinning around in circles, trapped. Wow, this is a weird bug. I can't jump or anything. <laughs> um, hmm. Interesting. What if I examine Pock? Oh, thank you, Pock. You freed me from my trap. That was weird. <laughs> I take it you moved your stuff over from the Nexus? Yeah, my squatter's paradise is all the more cluttered. What's up? Nothing. Thanks I'm for just chatting. grateful we'll I can move again. You know it. Instead of just spending the rest of my time spinning in your room. I still haven't decided what mission to do. This is too much. Did I even... Yeah, I finished looking through that. Uh, I should just pick one at random and hope for the best. Now orbiting 